Day. I'm here at the darkened shed. Uh, we'll have a look, look around. Sometimes the community shed's a great thing to be in, involved with. Um, this one is open for anybody from 16 and over and uh, it's very useful, particularly if you're on a farm and you haven't got all the gear you need. Uh, when I was building my shed in my house, I found that there were some features of the woodwork area that I used. Let's go and have a look at it. Go and have a look. This is this is the woodwork section. Very handy if you um, need to do any stripping of timber. Um, there's a circular saw and a planer and a thicknesser, a band saw, routing machine, and in the small hand tools we've got a few of those. Uh, the range of hand tools that we can all use. Very handy to have. So that's the woodworking section and here we've got a community centre area here where we can have meetings. Um, we have the Sunday morning markets here on the second Sunday of every month. It's got a little toilet built into the corner and we've got a kitchen area over there. And uh, when the markets are on we open these big sliding doors and we can set up the tables and we can have markets inside and outside. And in the third section, we've got the engineering area. Um, a lot of bits and pieces. We've got a folding machine. Someone's working on a caravan here. Uh, welding bays. I haven't used this area very much. I did come here at one stage when the power takeoff for my tractor got bent. And uh, this little press here was very, very handy. So that's the engineering section. We've got all sorts of tools locked away in there and the keys are hidden where everyone can find them. That's our workshop area. And that's the darkened community shed in the middle of the community. And more people should actually use it, but when you've got something to do on the farm and you haven't got the gear you want, that's a good place to come.